make a painted ladybug rock. The first thing we need to do is to gather our supplies. First, we need a protective cover for the table. You can use newspaper, scrap paper, an old placemat, an old towel, or an old sheet. Of course, we will need a rock. An oval or round shape rock works well. Here are some rocks that I found on a recent walk. Once you find the rock, wash it in water to get all the dirt off. Then allow it to air dry completely. You will also need acrylic paint in the colors of red, black, and white. Next, you'll have to get your painting tools. You can use a fine tipped and a broad or wide tipped paintbrush. You can also use Q-tips or cotton balls or pieces of sponge placed in the ends of a clothespin. Lastly, you will need cleaning supplies. A cup of water can be used to clean your brushes and paper towels are always good to have on hand. After setting everything up, let's begin. The first step is painting the rock red. I squeeze out a little bit of red paint onto a sandwich Ziploc bag. With my wide based brush, I make strokes from left to right across the rock to paint the surface. You can paint the entire rock or just the top and sides. Then let it dry. Once the red paint is dry, we can get out the black paint. Again, I've poured a little bit onto a Ziploc bag. Orient your red rock so that it is taller rather than wider. With a broad tip brush, you can then paint the bottom third of the rock with black paint using left to right strokes. With a finer tip brush, make a vertical line starting at the middle top of your red rock down to the black head of the ladybug, just as shown. Using the same fine tip brush dipped in black paint, have fun making circles in the red area of your ladybug. Lastly, using white paint and a fine tipped brush or a Q-tip, make two circle eyes centered in the black head of your ladybug. What a beautiful job you did. It's now time to clean up all your supplies and enjoy your rock. Please check back for more videos of other painted rocks.